Okay. Amazing. <laughs> so that means we've won. Hello, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Plutocracy. We're here in our nice warm office, uh, looking out of the window at the pouring rain of September. What a horrible, horrible time. We're not going to go outside anytime soon. Instead, we're going to head over to the bookcase and we're going to spend some of our skills. We've got five skill stars here that we need to spend. Um, I really enjoyed what we were doing with politics before. I think being able to lobby for laws is a great thing. So I'm going to put two stars into lobbying. Um, I'm then also going to put a couple of stars into economics as well. Try and get our economics score up to four. Five. Let's do bookkeeping and personnel. Very good. And we've got one star left. And I'm going to save that for when we think we really need it. Um, but as you can see, all of our uh, skills now are currently at, uh, at five stars. So pretty good. Politics reduces the risk of uh, exposure of, of corruption, which is pretty cool. Diplomacy... Uh, has 25 a 50% effect which is I think all to do with negotiations and economics is all to do with developments of our companies um, and, and technologies and whatnot um, I did read the newspaper and it does say that there's some elections coming up um, but honestly I'm a bit confused about elections and uh, and how, as a player, we would go about uh, running for election. I don't don't quite know how that works. Um, there is a an option here to nominate a candidate, but I'm not sure if we can actually nominate ourselves. If that's actually a if that's actually a thing. And in either case, it doesn't look like uh, any elections are going to be happening uh, in uh, in Arkansas until next year. Um, I don't know about places like Texas. Let's let's have a look at Texas uh, legislature. So, yeah, December eighteen eighty nine, December eighteen eighty nine, and the capital. Well, there is candidate registration is open at the moment, um, but I'm not sure if we can actually if we can actually nominate ourselves. We can sponsor people. But I'm not sure if we have to. Uh... So what's this? Candidate registration. Yeah. So now is this guy more likely to to win? I think this is this guy is more likely to win. But let's uh, let's go ahead and sponsor them, and that'll put them ahead in the race, which would be very nice. And let's get a provoker for for no reason. We would also make this person a puppet now so it might be worth hang on would we mm, it might be worth just sponsoring both of them it's always good to have a couple of puppets uh, let's get a good old lobbyist we definitely need more lobbyists now um, and can we nominate somebody else so somebody who's good at somebody with a low uh, exposure risk. Who have we got in charge here? Who are they? Well, they want to get sponsored as well. Let's let's have a good old butchers at this. So we could we could just throw money at them. They are already puppets, uh, so it wouldn't actually be beneficial. Um, that would only change marginally. We'll sponsor them. We'll get another lobbyist, and then we'll sponsor this guy as well. And what do we get out of this? Let's get a journo. Very cool. Um, yeah, and we should be able to... Sp I assume we should be able to spend our influence in order to make sh uh, the prosecutors and stuff um, people that we like. But the end of the term is November in 1888. So the end of term is coming up uh, very shortly uh, for... for Texas anyway so elections are going to be happening imminently I think so no point really spending influence to change these people at the moment we may as well wait um, but we have uh, done some jiggery pokery to make sure a favorable candidate is actually elected um, legislature it will take a little longer 
so I guess we'll wait on that and uh, yeah I guess we'll keep an eye on the old the old ballot paper I don't know if it's worth having a look at any of this stuff um, and see like who's allowed to to run for office and stuff I don't, don't know how all of these different laws really work so yeah don't think I'll be adding anything extra for now. Um, we've done all we can do on tax, so I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, okay, okay. So, uh, we've messed around with some of the election stuff going on in Texas. Let's have a filter and let's have a look at our banks again. Uh, we don't own all the banks, much to, much to my dismay, but we will try and get more... Um, more of them so we I think we currently own a hundred percent of the banks in Texas Arkansas and Missouri maybe it's worth going to somewhere like Iowa because Iowa seems to have very few banks so let's let's go to Iowa and uh, check out the situation on the ground oh actually can I before I go can I spend my money I'll buy a I'll buy a an office and I'll, uh, I'll finance the building of a library, a theatre, a hospital, a church, a university and of course that museum um, and that should increase our renown which which is always very good and uh, and yeah we'll, we'll leave state and we'll head over to uh, we'll head over to Iowa and we are here in Iowa and there is by the looks of it just the one bank um, it's not worth very much at the moment so that's kind of good for us it should be fairly easy for us to uh, for us to buy into um, let's look at the lowest price here and let's just try and get as many shares in this bank as we can and there's one signed there's two signed then three and finally number four so there we go we we own all of this bank now so the only bank in uh, in the state we own it so pretty darn good indeed let's uh, let's have a look at what's going on here we do have a terrible CEO let's see if we can find a good economic CEO who is unemployed and it looks like we can so uh, Julia Harris she doesn't want a lot of uh, a lot of money I'm unemployed and I've got five stars I could always become a CEO but I think I think if I want to get into politics, I can't be a CEO. So I'm not entirely sure, but um, yeah, let's not do that right now. Let's hire. Hmm. Yeah, Julia wants less money, so let's. Uh, oh, I have to right-click on her, don't I? Yes, yes, yes. I'm not. Never get used to that. So right-click, hire CEO. Very good indeed. Um. And then we'll we'll do the usual. We'll join the trust, and also we'll join the cartel, which won't which will increase the risk just slightly. Let's have a look at the reserve. So a good amount in reserve. I'm going to up the work plan. Of course I am. Uh, let's have a look at the work rate. So six nine. This is just well, it's going up. So and two. Oh. Just clicking on nothing. Seven three, seven four, seven five. Whoa, 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 whoa. Seven five. We'll apply that, um, and then I think we'll keep it seventy percent dividend rate for now, um, and we'll just let the CEO go away and uh, uh, yeah, and research stuff. Uh, okay, CEO specializes in that technology. Can I move the CEO around? I can. Oh, so I can tell the CEO. I could tell the CEO what to focus on. I should have known that. Uh, it used to be that you had a little picture of yourself and you moved the picture of yourself around and then they changed it and I haven't uh, kept up with what was going on. But now at least I know what it is. Uh, obviously I have uh, have the 100% of the share in the state and the whole of the US. It's one of the tiniest banks. Very small. Let's, uh, let's change that. Let's get a big expansion. Okay, very good. That is expanding. Um, and now let's uh, let's do what I really want to do. Let's try and buy the Venus to Milo. 
As you know, if you've watched before, the Venus de Milo is a good luck charm here on the here on the channel. Every time we get the Venus de Milo, we seem to we seem to succeed and go from strength to strength. Um, and I doubt this game is going to be any different. We only have the T set to go, and then we would have completed our antique antiquities collection. Wow, that was a mouthful. Um, <laughs> let's see what this is, uh, because now suddenly I'm interested. Raising can tax. I don't like the sound of that. Are we actually? Let's uh, let's check. Oh, let's check the map. So Iowa is the state we're currently in. Um, what's uh, what's the current income tax? Let's have a look. Uh, no, not there. Here, taxes, fourteen percent, and they want to raise the income tax. That sounds absolutely horrible. Um, can I lobby? I want to lobby for no. Uh, lobby against. Let's see if that's successful. Um, yeah, I guess we'll wait until the next event. And it has been successful. Um, yes. So, four people have been uh, lobbied to uh, not raise the income tax here. I, I don't think... Well, I'm pretty sure we, we aren't... Uh, we aren't puppeting the governor or anything like that at the moment the governor just does want a bank loan though so maybe we can fulfill their ambition and get them on side almost very almost what else do they want they want to acquire shares of uh, a transport company okay let's see how many they want also what, before i do that when when is the vote uh, 1888 so yeah, there might be a different governor in office very soon, so it might be worth waiting. Um, I am going to buy, I don't know if I should be doing this every time, but I'm going to buy an office here. Um, and I'm also going to just uh, support each of these, because I feel like that's a really good way for us to increase our, increase, increase our influence. Very good indeed. Let's have a look at this as well, see what else is going on. Uh, decrease infrastructure funding, uh, lower income tax across all of all of the USA. I kind of support that. It doesn't look like I have to lobby for it though. Um, what's okay? So it looks like everybody's in favour of lowering income tax. The income tax rate will be reduced to 0%. percent. Okay, that's pretty darn good. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'd, well, I'd be happy if that happens. You know, we won't complain about that. Um, yeah, and we'll just keep an eye on all of the uh, all of the other bits and pieces that are going on. Um, I think we should probably go to another state now, though. So let's let's have a look at banks again. So uh, banks, and at the moment, I was just looking for states with not too many banks. Um, but it might be worth. Uh, <laughs> so at the moment we've we've gone up here. We we own all the banks in all of these states. Um, but it's probably worth jumping into. Uh, well, should we just go up? Should we just make a big dividing line halfway through the country? Let's do that. Why not? Okay, we're here. Let's uh, filter by type. There are two banks. They are worth. A fair bit more than the previous bank. We should be able to buy out Collins and Partners without any issue. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, that's one at 56% of the shares, so pretty good. That's number two, number three, and finally number four. So that puts us 100% uh, of uh, Collins and Partners. Um, I'm going to do what I forgot to do previously, and I'm going to rename the company. So this, of course, is Banks Bank. Um, I don't know if it's worth doing this because I'm about to join a uh, join a trust anyway, and that'll change the name um, to Banks Trust Minnesota. Um, I'm also going to join the cartel uh, because, of course, I am. Uh, just just to double check how this works. So at the moment, we've got an income of 1.38 mil. When I join the cartel, it goes up to 2.33 mil. Yeah, so joining the cartel, absolutely a good thing to do. Illegal, but...
but definitely the way forward. Um, the CEO also, let's also keep an eye on that, 2.33. CEO is not very good. They've got a one star in uh, economics. So let's have a look for a five star CEO who is unemployed. There's one right here. This, this one here has the ambition to become a CEO. And they've also got three development things. So I don't know if these are good development things or not, but let's... Uh, oh. Let's, I need to do that again because I need to right click. I'm always forgetting the right click. Let's hire the CEO. So that fulfills his ambition. So I might uh, get a bit of loyalty. Uh, they're a five star CEO, as mentioned. So if we have a look at statistics now, 2.27. Don't know if that changed. Wasn't paying that much attention. Lots of money in reserve. So I might uh, pop that dividend up to 8%. Let's also increase that work plan to 200%. Work rate, uh, 6, 6, 6, 9, 7, 7, 5, 7, 7. So if you're not following what I'm doing, I'm uh, checking the net income here to see if it's actually going up. Happy to pay people more if it also means I'm earning more money. And I think that is the sweet spot. It also decreases the strike risk, which is very nice. And because we've got a fair amount of reserve here, I'm also going to opt for a company expansion with a big building. Um, and then we'll have a look at uh, the other bank in this state. I don't think we'd be able to buy it this round because we simply don't have the cash. Um, what could we do? Could we have a look at the stock exchange? Now, is it worth committing fraud? It might be. Let's, well, we've got 96 mil. Um, let's do exchange fraud for a price decrease. Let's just see what happens. Hopefully uh, it succeeds. So the price is gonna decrease for a good three days. So let's go to single day progression. And then, uh, right, so where are we at? 260. So we'll watch that. Uh, Decrease. I think we can maybe get away with a maximum of three days. One, two, oop. Yeah, let's vote for that. Why not? And three. I think this is like optimal. So we've got two choices now. We can either try and buy while the ask price is at 231 within the stock exchange, or we can. Uh, try and buy off one of these people. This person's calm, so I might be able to get some of the shares off of them at a discount. And that might be worth a try at least. Uh, and we can see if we can get a below asking price offer. Um, and if we can, we're on to a good, onto a good thing. I will compromise. So 231 is the ask. I'm gonna keep compromising. If we get below here, it would be good, but it doesn't really look like we will. I'm going to insist on the price. We'll probably cancel. Oh, okay, she's met us. Okay, so, uh, yeah, 215. Very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. So that was good because we got a below, uh, below stock exchange price on those, uh, on those shares as well. Um, all of these people more expensive uh, but I do have 29 mil in the bank to spend um, but you're you're asking yeah let's 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 try this guy um, if all else fails we can go back onto our uh, our etiquette so that we we don't make enemies but uh, hmm Let's compromise. I don't think we're going to be making a deal with this guy, by the seems of things. Let's compromise again, because I may as well just buy on the stock exchange. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna just buy on the stock exchange. I'm gonna um, uh, quit, and let's let's just hopefully our etiquette pulls us through. If it doesn't, we've got we've got ways of dealing with enemies. Okay, uh, we've got ways of dealing with enemies. Um, many different ways of dealing with enemies. Uh, so we'll we'll just see what happens. <laughs> uh, for now, let's go to the stock exchange. I'm gonna uh, buy a bunch here. Um, 
I, I, I think I'm just going to keep buying. I don't think I'm going to get a better deal if I uh, if I let it advance today. Maybe a day it will go down. But at any, at any moment it's just going to jump back up again. So I'm just going to buy... There you go. It's jumped way back up. Um, that's fine. I, I got quite a few shares at a good rate. I definitely need to put this to uh, has shares because I really hate seeing all of the bankrupt symbols up uh, up there. But uh, oh well, we've got got a fair few companies here. Lots of banks now, which is absolutely amazing. That's exactly what we wanted to do. We also have the opportunity to buy a tiger skin. So we, you know I'm going to do that, right? Uh, 266 is the market price. You are going to have to pay over the odds, but it's all worth it for a bit of extra renown. Let's uh, let's sit back and see if uh, see if the hitman actually succeeds. Uh, we have the lower income tax thing going on. I think it is close. It's very close. It's too late for us to lobby, so nothing we can do there. But let's see what happens. Um, and then I think it's too late for us to lobby in these as well so yeah November the 9th is when that's up so let's see what happens yeah wait okay this was <laughs> this was Arkansas reduce the maximum number of governor terms okay uh, Missouri Decrease infrastructure funding, Minnesota, increase education funding. Okay, lower income tax, fine. So we're just waiting on this one, that'll be November the 16th. So we'll, we'll wait and see what happens with that. Okay, so it looks like, it looks like the USA uh, House of Representative passed the uh, the bill to lower income tax um, to zero. So that's, that's good. Let's see what the Senate's doing. Senate looks like that's gonna pass as well. And then uh, the present the president, which is developing, um, we're developing the president right now. <laughs> uh, the president is probably going to approve it as well, I imagine. Um, we don't know. Uh, I don't think there's any point in me lobbying this, though, because it looks like the balance is... Well, yeah, even if even if the, the voters here that are undecided, even if they vote against... I think the the four will still have it so nothing really to worry about there let's keep an eye on our assassin though okay here's our assassin and they have successfully taken out our um, our enemy so very good indeed uh, I'm gonna wait until I get some more money before we take a pop at getting the rest of the shares in that bank though okay so it is January of 1889 and I did notice that there are um, elections going for the uh, US Senate and the House of Representatives. So we're going to give that a go and we're going to run for run for political office. Um, I don't know what the best one to run for is, um, whether it's the Senate or the, the office, uh, the, the Senate or the office, the Senate or the House of Representatives. I'm going to probably go for the Senate. At the moment, it looks like we're um, in the lead, but who knows if it'll stay that way. Uh, we do currently have four reputation hats. Uh, we probably want to get that up to five. So if I go person search, I'm going to look for somebody who I can give a loan to. Uh, so yeah, we're looking for people in available states and people who have doable ambitions I will let's just get rid of all of these a uh, moment and let's look just for just for loans okay this guy here needs a 25k loan that will absolutely do so let's do ambition we'll give him a loan and we'll get our reputation up by one um, yeah, so that's good. That's very good indeed. I don't know if there's any way for us to search for our opponent and maybe sabotage them or anything. So, Aiden Simmons. S-I-M-M-O-N-S. -M -M Simmons. Ah, so it's this guy here that we're going up against. So, 
let's use an agent on them. Let's do seduction. That would reset all of their skills to one. Um, let's also find dirt on them. And can we do anything else? Change their reputation. Well, we need dirt first. Um, so yeah, let's 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 do that and see what happens. We have the chance to buy a coin, so I might do that first. Because <laughs> yeah, if you get the opportunity to buy a coin, you have to buy a coin. Um, it's going to be an expensive coin though, <laughs> but uh, it all adds to our collection. So very good, really. Let's uh, let's continue. Is this guy? Yeah, there he is. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure this is the guy we're up against, right? Uh, let's just double check. Yeah, it looks like him. There's no, there's no way to click on him here, but let's let's go back to person search here. Let's go to his page. So I'm hoping to knock his diplomacy down to one if we can, and maybe ruin his reputation. I'm not sure if we've got enough time to do that though. Oh, and we're being blackmailed. Uh, Let's threaten the person who's blackmailing us. He's obviously our enemy. That doesn't seem to have worked. Hopefully we haven't taken a hit, but let's let's continue. Okay, hopefully this works. And it has. So at first he seemed incorruptible, but the what do you know? Aiden Simmons is hooked. Required influence points to unlock is decreased. Okay. Uh, oh, and here's our uh, person searching for dirt. Doesn't look like they've found any dirt. Oh, he's protected by a prosecutor. I had the I had to close the case. Hmm. Okay. So I can't knock his reputation down to zero. Annoyingly. Uh, is there anything else we can do? Uh, we can't write a bad article because we've got no dirt. Intimidation? Can we intimidate? How many days have we got here? When is the... Does it say when the election is? Uh, March the 4th. Uh, maybe, maybe we've got enough time to do that. So... Let's do... Yeah, let's try intimidation then. See what happens if we intimidate him. I don't know if this has an effect, but we'll, we, we, we can see. I'm going to threaten another blackmailer. It seems we're being blackmailed quite a lot now. Uh, I guess because we're running for, for politics. Okay, so I think we're only a couple of days away from the election now. Um, we do have this intimidation thing going on. Uh, let's just check on our character because we were blackmailed. So yeah, look our... Uh, our reputation took a hit so I'm gonna try and find some more people that we can um, give a loan to let's do uh, let's see yeah, let's get rid of that let's filter it on doable actions uh, we're, we're gonna go for loans and uh, only available states very good and we'll just give some credits to some people who aren't asking for too much money and then use the uh, use the benefit to get a uh, an increase in reputation again um, it also occurs to me that we should probably buy all of this stuff here so that or finance it at least so that we uh, make sure our renown is increased so everybody knows who we are we may as well get an office as well I suppose will cost us some influence but I think it's worth it and yeah we'll just see just see what happens uh, March the 2nd for the intimidation I don't know if that's gonna have any impact um, on things it might do not too sure and it didn't work so that's fine let's uh, let's go into the election and see what happens then right here we go then this is the election mini game so we should have five hats so let's see what's going on so renowned by electorate 
Uh, 100% of the people know who we are, but only 22% of the electorate know who our opponent is. Uh, we've got 45% of the supporters at the moment, and they have 12%. Um, and we have 45, 44% of the sympathies, whereas they have 55%. So we'll just see how things play out. Um, I guess we're looking for uh, these these bars here to see how much of that particular group we can influence uh, to to support us. What is this? This looks like a good one. Splurge adds one cell of sympathy among ten random groups. So this is worth ten. So that's definitely better than three. So, uh, I can't do this. I can't increase coverage because everybody knows who I am. So I use my reputation here. So we should have five reputations, so this will take us down to four. But this should uh, give us ten, repu ten cells of influence across across all, all groups. So that should increase our uh, increase our share of the vote at least slightly. They've used reputation uh, negatively against us. I'm going to. Uh, play around with this a few times to see what we can get so a four what can that get us you know it could get us uh, the remainder of the Republican vote here so that might be worth it oh they've got a six so they've just taken all of the females so that's quite bad um, let's do this one again a four is pretty good. We can maybe take the middle classes. Oh no, we need a three for the middle classes. What can we use a four for? Darn it. Maybe not. Um, let's, yeah, let's roll it. What does this one do? Your opponent misses a turn. That would be a good one to do uh, at the end if you're winning. I think. Um, but actually, opponent missing a turn is good at any point. Probably. Uh, so four points. Hmm. Maybe not the best uh, in retrospect. Although one, two, three, four. That would actually be the religious vote there, or the males. So that's twenty-three thousand, and that would be forty-four thousand. So yeah, let's do religious. They've increased their rep by ten across the board. Um, this is bad. So let's. Mm, is it bad? Yes, it is bad. Mm. I would like to get uh, like two modules there if I could. What does this do? Sympathy is a five random groups of your opponent lose two cells. So that wouldn't be too bad to do. But let's save our um, reputation because our reputation seems quite powerful. Let's increase sympathies if we can. A six that would be an entire group. Is there anything where we can take an entire group? Maybe we could take all of the uneducated voters. So what would that be? 14,000? Atheists are 7,000. The elderly are 7,000. Yeah, let's, let's take the uneducated. They've increased their coverage. Uh, or we could sabotage so the opponent misses a turn. Which sounds fun. Effectively, we miss a turn as well because we spend a turn sabotaging. Um, but So I don't really want to do that yet. A five. Where's a five handy? So we could do non-partisans. Um, we could get the young on board, mostly on board anyway. Hmm, let's roll again. A three. Ah, uh, three would be good for the middle classes or the mature. I know I need, need a two for that. Or we could get the rest of the college uh, students, or college educated rather, 14,000 in total. Um, some of the rich, some of the elderly. Let's let's roll to try and get a two. We've just got a five, which wasn't exactly what I'm looking for. 
Oh no, now we have a two here. I can use that on the middle classes. They've increased their coverage again, which increases their share of the vote. Um, what was a four good for? The young. Males, one, two, three, four. Yeah, we could use a four for males. Oh, they've increased their coverage again. Every time they do that, they, they chip away at what we can do. Um, other big groups out there then. Hmm. College students. What's that in total? 14,000? So we'd increase our, our share by 7,000. I feel like we need uh, to get a 2. If we can get a 2, that would be pretty good. 6. 2. Yeah, we're going to do that. I'm going to take European. Okay. Now, uh, if we can... How many university are there? 7,000. So we could use a five here. We could, we could use five on the elderly. Nobody's uh, taken any of the elderly vote yet. Or we could go for all of the non-partisans. Hmm. Or all of the atheists. So that's 7.37. 7.37. Let's plonk that into the elderly. They're always known to turn out. They're increasing their coverage. Um, this is the last go, so let's see if we can get the sabotage thing come up. Uh, slander, select population group. Right, sabotage, your opponent misses a turn. Let's do this. Okay! Amazing! <laughs> So that means we've won. Epic. Okay, so I guess this is 40,000 votes versus 18,000 votes, which is pretty good. Uh, I guess they spent money to increase renown. Uh, we Our reputation took a bit of a hit because we used some reputation in order to, to get voted in. But yeah, I think I think this means we won and we are now a politician. So there you go, powerful USA figure. Very good indeed. Um, I don't know what that means, <laughs> but let's, uh, let's have a look. So US Senate and House Representatives election completed. Very good. Um, and let's have a look at this then. So that's Minnesota, that's Arkansas. If I go on to uh, federal government, uh, that's us. Yeah. What What are we? Are we anything? We're just a random person. I guess we're just a random person. We don't seem to control many of the politicians. I don't know if that's something that we are able to do. Um, okay. Interesting anyway, I suppose. Uh, available seats. Who's got the most renown? Oh, we've got the most renown, easily. Hmm. Okay. Not quite sure what it means to be a politician, but I guess we'll find out. <laughs> um, okay, let's, uh, let's get back to... Our, how do we get back to our office? There we go. We're back in our office, finally. Um... Let's uh, let's check out where we're at. So at the moment, uh, we're worth 2.39 bill. We've got 160 mil coming in. I'm pretty sure our opponent's doing pretty well. Yeah, they're worth a bill. And they've got uh, 53 million coming in. We did have a bank that we were trying to buy in this state. Um, but I think we're going to have to leave that for next time. Uh, when we try and figure out what being a politician actually means. <laughs> Um, but thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this today. Um, if you have, leave a like, comment, subscribe, all of those lovely things. And until next time, goodbye.